Hello everybody, April 11th, going on 4 o'clock Eastern Time, just, we dodged the bullet. <laughs> I just thought I'd take a look to see what the people on uh, NASA and NORAD and Space Command is looking like right now. So let's take a peek and see their reaction. <laughs> What I noticed about this situation, this near miss, that only three of us covered it on YouTube. Probably got all combined maybe a hundred thousand views. I just saw it on Twitter X just recently, but wasn't even touched. Didn't even cover this. Didn't even know about it. 99.99 billion nines after that didn't know what, what just occurred. But it was only three of us. So now, you know, Earthmaster, World News Today, and myself. So now that that's passed, for now, we can resume our normal schedule programming. Just post it. And asteroid on april 9th missed us <laughs> i wasn't there imagine how many already hit like that situation in south africa a couple of days ago where high winds came out of nowhere blowing cars trucks out of the bridge out of the highways it was yeah this was april 9th where we had trucks being blown off the highway storms out of nowhere so who knows if we already had impact before little small ones that caused these devastations out of nowhere so resume back to our normal program and I'll keep looking up and looking at the stars, the comet and the test that I kept referring to here in Florida. I, I kind of mentioned it. And also another thing too, all my observatories that I looked were all clouded in every single location, Japan to Hawaii, for example, I was watching this and this is basically what it looked like during the, the event. The observatory was clouded, couldn't see nothing. My site in Japan was clouded, couldn't see nothing. I had a tremendous storm here. We had tornadoes nearby. Okay, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome. I'll do my best. Keep my eyes up. Until next time, Beth Father out.